While flagship phones continue to increase in price year after year, an increasing number of customers are seeking less expensive and budget smartphones that don't break their bank. In this video, I am going to show you the best phones under $500 you can buy in 2022. Number 1 on the list of best budget phones of 2022 is Apple iPhone 11. The iPhone 11 isn't a brand new model. Although it was introduced in 2019, it has aged beautifully and evolved into a fantastic mid-range phone. The iPhone 11 is included in this list because I believe it is still the finest value for money smartphone available. For $499, you get a strong CPU, lots of RAM to run iOS smoothly, a huge battery, and a well-made device. Its design has also weathered the test of time, as it isn't all that unlike from modern Apple phones. The screen is where its age shines the brightest. Its 6.1-inch screen has only HD plus quality, large bezels, and is an LCD display at the end of the day. The OLED panels on the 2020 iPhones are all high resolution. The camera system in the Apple iPhone 11 is fantastic, with a 12MP primary camera and a 12MP ultrawide camera. Number second is Samsung Galaxy A53, which was released very recently. This phone features an excellent camera combination and a superb 120Hz refresh rate screen. The Exynos 1280 CPU in the Galaxy A53 isn't a terrible chip, and it provides enough of performance. This phone also has a lovely look and a wonderful software experience. The Galaxy A53 5G's other advantages are its long battery life and outstanding build quality. This is an excellent phone for people of all sorts, especially those who do not want to replace their phone every two years. With a price tag of $449, the Galaxy A53 5G is a sure bet. Number third on the list is Google Pixel 5a phone from last year has the potential to be one of the greatest mid-range phone on the market. It features a 6.34-inch OLED display with Full HD Plus resolution. Although the refresh rate is just 60 Hz, this isn't a major issue because the device's clean Android OS should be sufficient. Even while it doesn't feature the most up-to-date chipset, the Snapdragon 765G it employs nevertheless packs a punch. The Pixel 5a has a storage capacity of 128GB and 6GB of RAM. This phone, like all Pixel phones, also have excellent photographic capabilities. It sports a dual camera system with a 12MP primary camera and a 16MP ultrawide camera. The Pixel 4a's main flaw was its below-average battery life. The new Pixel 5a attempts to address this by including a bigger 4680 mAh battery. However, the fingerprint scanner on this phone is on the back, which was acceptable in mid-range phones, but is no more. At the very least, you may expect to be the first to receive new Android software for years to come. Number 4 on the list is Motorola Edge 2021. This attractive Motorola phone was previously priced at $699, but it has now been reduced to only $449. The Edge 2021 has excellent specifications and is of good quality. The Snapdragon 778 CPU is paired with 8GB of RAM and 256GB of expandable storage in this phone. The screen on this phone is a large 6.8-inch 144Hz Full HD Plus display. The fact that this panel is LCD rather than AMOLED is a disadvantage, but if that isn't a deal-breaker for you, know that it is still a fantastic screen. The Motorola Edge 2021 comes with a triple camera system that includes a 108MP primary camera and an 8MP ultra-wide camera. These cameras are more than competent for the price of the phone and can produce some nice-looking photos. Although the video recording is limited to 4K 30fps which is not a big issue I believe. The OnePlus 8T is on number 5 on the list of best budget smartphones. This one's inclusion on the list may come as a surprise to some, However the new OnePlus Nord 2 isn't available in the United States, so we believe this was the best option. The OnePlus 8T has been around for a year, but it began off as a flagship phone, so it's still a beast. This device's 120Hz AMOLED screen is still one of the best, as is its processor and RAM, which provide plenty of performance. With an aluminum frame and a glass back, the OnePlus 8T is likewise a well-made and premium-feeling phone. Don't be concerned about it being old. It isn't, especially since it supports 5G. It doesn't have the largest battery, but it will get you through the day. The OnePlus 8T is now available for just under $500 on the company's web shop, making it a great value. Last we have TCL 20 Pro 5G to be the best smartphone under $500.
TCL20 Pro 5G is a well-looking and stylish smartphone with outstanding specifications for the price. The display is a 6.67-inch AMOLED with Full HD Plus resolution. Unfortunately, because it has a 60Hz display, this phone does not have a high refresh rate. Despite this, the Snapdragon 750G chipset should provide lots of performance. The TCL20 Pro 5G has a lot of RAM. The phone has a 6GB RAM and a 256GB extendable storage capacity. Given its budget, this phone includes an under-display fingerprint scanner, which is a nice feature to have. The TCL20 Pro 5G sports a 48MP quad camera system that can shoot 4K video at 30 frames per second. The phone is powered by a 4500 mAh battery and supports 18 watts fast wired charging and 15 watts fast wireless charging. The TCL20 Pro 5G sports a 3.5mm headphone jack in addition to a micro SD card slot, which might make it particularly desirable to audiophiles. So the question is, why spend $1,000 on a flagship phone when you can get a fantastic phone for half that? Well, it depends on your needs, but the reality is that you don't need to spend too much money to have long-lasting equipment. Let me know your favorite budget smartphone if it is not on the list. I will see you again very very soon.